Welcome to Vanadium. This is Chris Rankin. The more I learn about this mad world, the more mysterious it seems. The universe has a size limit, smaller than which things stop making sense. When something gets too tiny, it can slip right through the cracks of reality itself. Normal non-spooky objects can get pretty small. Think of a certain controversial virus. It's basically a round spiky ball with a diameter of 50 nanometers, or 50 times 10 to the minus 9 meters. To put that into perspective, your arm might be around 1 meter long or 1,000 million nanometers. This minimum allowable size in our observable universe is a lot smaller than even the tiniest virus, a lot smaller than even 1 nanometer. The smallest size that can fit into reality is called the Planck length, and it's unimaginably minuscule. One could comfortably fit one billion 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 viruses across just one Planck length. The smallest distance that's ever been close to being measured by science is the size of an electron. This is the smallest object any microscope or specialized instrument can probe. Its size is around 10 trillion Planck lengths. The amount of time it takes light to cross one Planck length is called the Planck time. This is the smallest duration of time that has any physical meaning. It's not so much that something can exist that's smaller or faster than this Planck scale, it's that below this limit, there's no way to measure or detect information related to the event. The theories of quantum mechanics break down at this point. Einstein described reality as a kind of foam or net that could let some things slip right through. It's possible that in the future there could be a grand unified theory that can explain and predict phenomena at any physical scale. But science isn't close. I sometimes wonder, could something be too large for the universe to hold on to? Maybe we're the subatomic to someone else's humongous universe, and we would never know it because they're too big to make sense of. Thank you very much. This was Chris Rankin with Vanadium.